And this is the Sidewinder <coughs> Maiden. Once again, uh, designed by Dan Spawnholz. This is my second, I believe my second uh, Spawnholz plane. Um, but this is the, I don't know why the penny finally dropped. I've only been flying for about eight years, but the penny finally dropped that it's much better to have a plane that flies well than looks good. So if you can kind of find a happy medium, then that's great. When I built the Foam Wonder, um, Dan's version of the Sig Wonder, uh, but in foam, I I just love that plane. And it usually comes out with every flight, but today is the maiden for the Sidewinder, as usual, for good luck. No color. Uh, I already have some homemade decalage that I'm going to put on here if I have success. And by all accounts, it should be good. So I'm going to shut up and, and you're probably going, really? Are you? We'll see here. I'm just going to check the everything. Looks good. Looks good. Yeah. Throws maybe too much. I have exploited about 55 or 60. Oh, bring her down. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to have to decrease the throws big time. I have to really baby the sticks. So I could have launched that at about 30%. I'm at 40 right now. Bring it down even more. Nice. What's going on? Getting it dialed in. So gentle on the sticks. Decrease the throws and it should be okay. Okay, this is a great plane too. <laughs> so great when you do a maiden and it just kills. See how touchy that is, right? Okay, get up a bit higher and try some stuff. Wow, this thing is super responsive. Piece of cake. Oh! <laughs> Bring her down. Battery. Three minutes. Battery hanging. <laughs> oh my goodness. So, just a little gonk on the on the one wing from that rollover. But uh, as you saw, the battery dropped. And the reason is, this platform I made for it, went an idiot. Maybe if I glue it in? <laughs> oh well, I love this hobby, man. 